Hey guys, welcome to the Stealthy Crafter. I'm Jessica and today we have an unboxing for you guys. Um, today's unboxing is called The Dragon's Door uh, by Raven Phelan from Diamond Art Club. It is a square diamond painting and it is 70 by 99 centimeters. So it's a big one guys. Um, so let's get into this, all right? I hope you guys are doing well as I'm cutting all this plastic off. Um, still trying to get over a bit of a cold. Like, I can't, can't seem to cut it, get, um, get rid of it. But, you know, we'll eventually get rid of it. <laughs> but I do hope you guys are doing okay today. It is really sunny and hot, but, um, I always wear my long sleeves in, indoors because of the AC. <laughs> but, alright, let's open this big thing. Holy cow. Alright. Get all of this out and we'll start looking through what everything is in here. Whew, it's heavy. Alright, so first off we have our logbook sticker. Um, so what you can do with a logbook sticker is originally I used to be putting these on the bottom of my boxes uh, just so that way I could tell what kits I had. But now that I have a new system, it's kind of useless. <laughs> but what you can do with a logbook sticker is if you have a logbook, um, you could put them on your, um, you can put them in your book and then you can write down the details like the start date, your end date, how many colors, what your thoughts were. Um, what a lot of people are doing nowadays, there's like a Coverminder by Bella Art de Nicole and a couple other places that I've seen where you can like slide this in um, And it's like so that way you can have this shown on your project while you're doing videos or taking pictures and stuff like that um, I haven't really thought about getting that one yet, but um, but yeah, there we go Then we have our old toolkit nothing wrong with that it's just a bit older than the, some of the new stuff, so if you got your new toolkits, they would have like um, washi tape and cover minders. But let me pull all of this out and we'll go through each and everything. Alright, so the first thing up is we have our diamond painting pin with a matching squishy. Then we have a thin floor, place, uh, floor multi placer. Next up is our lovely little baggies. We have a bunch of them. In the new toolkits, they'll be like wrapped up in one big baggie. Then we have our heart-shaped wax right here. We have two of them, by the way. And then we have plastic tweezers. Since this is a square kit, we have our plastic, not plastic tweezers. <sighs> Words are hard, guys. So since this is a square kit, we have our uh, tweezers. And then we have our boat or tray however you like to call it all right put that off to the side next up is our dust cover now as the words dust cover shockingly enough means you know it's going to cover protect it from dust all the elements and fun stuff like that we will just open this up and we'll throw that to the side <laughs> I know, I, I throw stuff to the side all the time. <laughs> Alright, now we'll slide everything out. And make sure that nothing else is in there. Alright, we have our drills. I'll put that there. We'll, we'll go through all those in just a moment. So this is a poured glue canvas, which means that I am able to roll this up without it having any concerns about, like, bubbling and rivers and you know all that fun things like we won't like come off so now this thing is pretty big um so i won't be able to get the entire thing in camera so i will have to scoot this around just so that way you guys can see the majority of it but here we go Whew. all right as you can see this thing is gorgeous, isn't it? Holy cow. All right. Oh, my goodness. So one of the first things you can see is um, we have, I'm going to have to scoop this all the way down. We have up top here is the Do What Makes You Sparkle. Um, and then if we go to the side all the way here, we have the Legend. 
And then if we go further down, we have the legend on the other side as well. But what I'm going to show you is the thumbnail with the licensing details right here. Um, then right here in the middle is the social uh, social media. And then right at the end is our lifetime warranty. So what do you guys think about this? Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my goodness. Um, one of the things I really like is like how it looks like it's glowing. You know, like how the dragon looks like it's glowing right here. I, I just, I'm, I'm obsessed with it and I've been wanting to get this for a while. But it's so cute. I like how there's like runes right here. And then if you see right here, it's kind of like a, like it says it's a dragon store. So you have the big door knocker right here. And then like if you see here, like it's torn off and you have a, a bunch of like the galaxy in the background. And all the way down here as well. I really love um, Raven Phelan's artwork. I like their unique style. And it's... I really love how how their eye seems so expressive. Like, if you look here, it's just, I love how it looks right here. Um, <coughs> sorry, excuse me. Um, uh, one of the things you can see right here is that there is going to be a lot of, a lot of color blocking. Um, if you don't know what color blocking is, um, that means that you would be able to multi-place huge bunches of color all at once. And then, like, if I say confetti, it just means that you'll be putting a bunch of colors in, like, a small singular section that you're constantly switching your colors out. But I love this, like, if you, like I said, it looks like it's glowing, but if you also look, it's kind of just, like, how it feels like it's, like, warm and there's, like, a toasty fire in a way. Like, from here, down here where the wings are. Um, and then it kind of just slowly goes back to being kind of coldish up here. I really like that. Um, I know I kind of skipped around a little bit here because normally I would start talking about the step-by-step -step instructions here and then going to the uh, to this next thing. So I apologize. <coughs> anyway, we have our step-by-step -step instructions here. If you look here, we also have the tips and tricks and then um, how it works. So if you want to do that, uh, if you're curious, if you're new here, if you're curious and you don't know how to diamond paint, if you look up videos, there's a bunch of tutorials and things of explaining how to do that. Also, we have our inventory sheet, um, which shows what uh, the legend on the side kind of gives you that here, but they're pre-cut stickers. Um, so that way you can peel these off and put them on your storage containers or baggies. Uh, we looks like we have 43 colors and I think two ABs, if I remember correctly. Um, then we also have a bigger sticker, which is what I use. I cut this out and use this um, as my logbook sticker instead. But you can do whatever you guys want with it. Um, and we have all the other details on that. So just put that to the side. And then we have this humongous pal of drills. It is a lot. It is a big canvas, so that makes sense. So we'll go through these and then we'll start pointing out where all the ABs are located. All right. So first off, we'll go with these. So it looks like we have two bags of $8.98. And then we have a bag of 646, 300, 742, uh, 947, 3799. And we got one, two, three, four bags of those. Then we have a bag of 317s. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six bags of those. Holy cow. Then we have um, 413 and we got one, two, three, four, five, six bags of those. Then next up we have is 3823, then 321, 433, and then we have our first AB which is 132. Um, so if you guys don't know what AB stands for, it stands for 
Aurora Borealis. And what that means is that it has like an iridescent, um, iridescent coating on the drill itself to kind of give it a little extra sparkle um, compared to the other drills. It almost gives it like a rainbow effect if you look here closely. Um, and it looks like we have two bags of those. Then we have 550, two bags of 823, uh, 400, two bags of 700. Then we have 934, 3860, and there's two bags of those. Then we have one, two, three bags of 939, then one, two, three bags of 938. All right, let's see, we'll go with this one. Then we have 3371, one, two bags of those, two bags of 779, and then one, two, three, four, five, six bags of 310. And then our last string of drills we have here, we have 355, 600, 3607, 208, 3772, 996, 917, 434, uh, 935, 814. Then we have our second AB, which is 141. Uh, then we have 797, 435, 666, 301, 150, 498, 327, 743, and 606. Now, like there's not really a lot of ABs in this canvas itself, but from the pictures that I've seen of people who have completed it, it doesn't really need that many, even though you think uh, it would need a lot more. It still looks, the way the colors are put around together makes it look so stunning and I just love it. Um, let me figure out where all the ABs are located. So I see like the ones that we were talking about. So those oranges, they're like right here on the uh, mane of the dragon itself and around the mouth. Um, they're also kind of on the edges right here where the runes are. Some of the runes do have that orange AB. We got some orange ABs here and here. Of course, the whites are right here and here. Uh, there wasn't too many whites, and it looks like there's some here for the galaxy as the stars itself. Um, and of course, if we go a little further down, all throughout the wings, we have the ABs as well. So let me see if I can fold this in just a little bit so I can point that out right here. And also on the tail, we have the orange ABs and the white ABs. Um, so what do you guys think of this canvas? Uh, do you guys like it? Um, if not, or do, tell me in the comments below. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want. <laughs> um, otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.